So, in case you don't know how to Twitter or tweet, as the case may be, Katie is going to teach us how. Yeah, the best part about Twitter is it's so incredibly easy. And if you thought Facebook was easy, mm -hmm. this is like even more intuitive. All you do is you go to Twitter.com. You cannot right. miss this big orange w button. www.http okay. colon slash slash. Mm -hmm. Okay, you get it. All right. The sign up button is huge. It's orange. It takes you to the next page. You right. get to create your own username. Uh -huh. You get to create a profile picture, a little right. background. There's people that are 104 that were on Twitter. Really? So if they are, you can be. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you've signed up. Then yes. what happens? Okay, that's the best part about it. So Twitter is all about following people and following people you find interesting. You can follow friends and family. Mm -hmm. You can follow the president. I like to actually follow a lot of sites that do something for me. Retailmenot.com is a great example. They give me coupons. Yes. I even have an ice cream shop up the right. road that right. if I go in there and say the secret promo code every mm -hmm. day, which always sounds really ridiculous, right. you know, they give me a discount. Uh, Mark <laughs> Noller, who is uh, one of our White House correspondents, yes. is, is an amazing person on Twitter because he tells you really interesting things all the time. Yeah, and I was thinking you would be too, but then I found out on your Twitter account that you haven't signed in in like a year. Well, I, so I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> I decided I wasn't that interesting. No, you really are. <laughs> You're like breaking news stuff. Yeah, all of that stuff. All right. <laughs> uh, there are good twi tweets and there are bad tweets. What's yes. a, what's, tell, help us understand. First, show us a bad tweet. Yeah, okay. Things that drive me crazy, the most powerful CEOs and executives that have thousands of followers, mm -hmm. they put some bitty, pretty bad tweets up there, and it's like right. embarrassing for them. Right. Example, bad tweet. Oh, I'm feeling a little tired, gonna have a green tea. Like, what does that bring to the table? I don't know. Which is my argument about Twitter. But you can't have a good tweet. For example, right. if I want to go on now and say, hey, we'll turn on the early show, mm -hmm. we're talking about Twitter 101, right. you can yeah. learn some stuff. Right. It's real time, yes. you can then tune in. Right. Awesome. But my, how do you rake through, <laughs> the, how do you get the, separate the wheat from the chaff, as it were? Okay, that's on you, because oh. you want to follow good people that you know are going to be informative. Oh. For me, for example, my uh -huh. world is the tech world. Mm -hmm. I get a lot of my real-time news faster than I do on a lot of news stations just okay. by following good people right. on Twitter. All right, and how do you find out then what others are tweeting? Exactly. So you go to your homepage, and right. every time I sign in and go to my homepage, mm -hmm. every one of the people that I'm following will pop up. Uh -huh. So it's just that easy. And remember, this is real time, and right. hopefully you are following people that have informative things to say. All right, so, so say for instance, you yes. go, you can tweet, help me find blah, blah, blah. Exactly. Or what's the best site for blah, blah, blah. Or okay. who's the best person for Blah, blah, blah. So, for example, if I want to find breaking news, mm -hmm. I'll key in, I'll search CBS. Mm -hmm. Automatically, I can see all the CBS channels that I can follow. CBS right. Health, CBS Tweet, CBS Breaking News. Right. And then if I want to follow them, all I do is hit follow, and then instantly I can see their entire feed. So it's just that easy. Wow, it is really And with easy. a site like CBS, it's cool because the news is constantly being updated, right. so it's keeping you in the know. Okay. That's an example of good tweets. Okay, those are good tweets. Uh, but you also need to understand the vocabulary, yes. right? Can you teach us, give us a little vocabulary? <laughs> the Twitter world has this whole vocab, and that's mm -hmm. all you need to know is a few things. Right. So the first one you need to know is the at symbol. If you put the at symbol before any username, right. that means you're sending that person a message. Oh. Pretty simple. Then we're also going to talk about retweet. That's uh -huh. RT. And that's actually just short for, okay, say one of my friends sends something really interesting. Right. Maybe my friends want to see that too. I can actually retweet, and I'll show you how easy it is. Yeah. I can retweet that message mm -hmm. by clicking the retweet button. Right. And it's just that simple. Now that message will appear okay. on my profile page. All right, follower versus following, what is that? Okay, so you can follow people that are interesting and then people can follow you and get your messages. Okay. Twitter is all about following and followers. All right, Katie, thank you very much. Yay, get back on Twitter, Harry. Okay, dude. <laughs> And if you're already on Twitter, you can follow us there at twitter.com slash The Early Show. 